Good morning. How's it going? Franklin's digging his new place. Check him out. He's so proud. Hi. <laughs> Moving right along with this huge project. Today we're going to open up the entryways on the sides. On the east side with this bridge and on the west side with this bridge. So what I plan to do is to continue this green road. We're just going to break it open and extend it out over there and that'll connect it to the bridge. So mostly dirt printing. Yay. Not too much though. So we've got the three wide and then the border. There we go. That's not terrible. That didn't take too long. Still more work to do, but lay this down. It's probably where it'll start to ramp up. We're going to need some more green path. And take this up. And what do we have over here? We have black and then it drops down one level for iron. So I would need another interesting. So that would need to bring it up a level or two to make it look like that. Hmm. Yeah, we're going to run out of materials. Kind of expected though. And I don't think I've picked up any more black paint recently, but we'll fill it in as we can to this side. So actually we'd probably cut it off, bring it up here where the iron ends this back for the ramp to go here and that's when we will we'll take this up so we can make it stand out just outside of that iron right there might do some kind of step like that maybe that's the level and then you see there's trees in the way we're gonna have to get a chainsaw we've got one otherwise i like to keep the palm trees they're very scenic and i like them okay that's our our level off right there. It's interesting because that bridge is so close, but we're going to keep them separate. And I think because of the look of this, I want to put a fence here that you can kind of see through. Yeah. How do I handle this? I think we'll plant the tropical stuff back here. You can kind of build it back out a little bit. It's hard to make it look like it was, you know, you can try to make it look natural, but it never will be the same. All right. Now to level this stuff out, I'm going to swap out my dirt printer. I'm very close to my charger. That's helpful. So this is over a little bit. See that? It's not too bad. I think I'll pull this back a little more than I thought. Ah, I think we're almost there. The shape anyway. Hmm. This will go back. And this will... No. This is going to have to be raised so that it is separate. Yeah. That should be tall enough. And then we'll match it here. Mm -hmm. That looks even. The steps are off a little. I think we'll do that. I don't know. That's not right. We can just push everything back. Yeah, cool. So just kind of carved it out and now I'm going to make it even again. This is where it's going to be tricky though. So we're pulling this wall out. We can take it down a little bit though. Hmm. How do we make that make sense? Will a green wall just work like that? And then will be a fence that comes up to here. Take some of the fence from the back. Just make it easier to visualize what we're doing. I think I want that to come in like this one does. So like that, and you can see the fence and we'll put palm trees and things here, like this lush tropical. So we have the outer edge being, I think the inner edge is supposed to be that. I think this is gonna have to come down and be iron. Yep, that's right. That looks better. Let's walk around here and see how that... Okay, so what material will the rest of it be? Be green on green? Most of I, my entryways have this mossy green brick. It makes me want to pull that back. Mm. I'll just take that and then there could be trees here and they could grow. I'm going to cover this side of this wall. Hopefully you can see the entryway that way. And we're going to make one this way too. So now I can see that I want iron to go all the way to the green brick. I just lay that down and not worry about it. I uh, wish I could just get all my 10 fences done. No, so they need to come to the iron. Yeah, like that. Yeah. And then this bridge is over there. This so we're going to have a path that goes down there. I'm off by one. This, this is the black, not the iron. Ah, so I have that path is, is there to protect, keep this rock. <laughs> I just decorated around it. Hopefully I can work with this because I'm seeing that I would want the steps here, but I think we're going to should push them back. Yeah, to make room for this road. So that would go to there because that's where the bridge is here, down here. And this one would go down and there it is. Awesome. Cactus in the way. You need to eat something. Berry bread. 
right i kind of have it carved out so really just got to pick my material and then lay it down and, and that'll define it even more so we definitely need green we're gonna have to find some black somewhere i've normally been pulling this out a little bit no actually only where the, the ramp will be okay look at that blue franklin house it's so blue and that's so yellow <laughs> and blue do i have a mining helmet i do i've got two black paint i think i have to use both of them to wrap this up i think this iron fence is gonna look good and we'll take some more ramps and trusty stone lanterns so the opposite side had pattern stone it's kind of like the anchor points so i should do that but they need to be raised we'll do green just outline the whole thing good deal and then the green path black path ramps that's pretty clean and black path and i forgot the end piece where the ramp is needs to be up one higher than the others and that's where we put the light you can see it over there I'm gonna sleep finish it tomorrow all right let's finish this up that was green 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 we'll finally see some more green on the map not a lot but some put some ramps there i wonder if it's gonna look weird to have a different fence maybe we won't put a fence on this i didn't on the other one either <laughs> doc is barking at me are you stuck down there why did you even spawn there or did you chase the bird? Hmm. All right. This definitely needs a fence. Nice. So far, so good. I don't think I can not make this so sharp of a turn. Yeah, that's better. I keep thinking I've made enough of the bright green tile and I need a little bit more. <laughs> Wait, not pattern tile there. It's going to be regular brick. And then pattern tile here. Yep, that matches. And we'll put brick here. Stone lantern. Brick stone lantern seeing i want to put some kind of something here because otherwise i mean it's not that far of a drop off but still a drop off i don't think i want it two different levels so what could we put there some kind of fence i just don't think that the flat top fence would fit in very well there it's maybe hardwood hmm, maybe some kind of flower boxes all oh, right i like the hardwood it goes well with that green yeah that looks pretty good and you just go right into oh that's smooth see from the top what a nice intersection i did make some flower boxes too much let's have one and we'll check on the other side brick and a stone lantern we're only gonna have the fence on the top we need six green tiles and then what's gonna go up here how about that wait brick <laughs> kind of backwards brick and stone lantern uh, that looks good uh, look how the mangrove is grown around that there's one down there i gotta get it gotta get it Let's see no not jackhammer chainsaw ah very nice and this side should have white tile to match this side and we have some ramps left not a lot but it's enough for this job uh, that's so good so i'll match this side well, opposite and put one of those there and I'm gonna put summer lilies in these boxes it's subtle but nice wow it's like it's always been there let's see let's go back a little ways just take a walk up to the area and also you can see the fenced part now I haven't touched that portion yet but see how the fence is gonna look and all of this up here will be natural I actually want to lay the tropical grass so it'll grow whatever it wants naturally okay that looks good to me there's one little weird section sticking out here just bring that down a little Get some grass all right now uh, let's check out the other side okay so the nice ramp gotta fill in these green tiles here we go and you can see over to the river um see i don't have enough to fill this all in <laughs> So I think I'm going to leave it that way because I think that's fine for it to change paths that close to a bridge. And then this side, I just want to lay out this white tile. And so it's continuous with this one. So you can get right over to the mines. Whoa, John. What's up, John? Come over here and check this out. Hey. Anyway, so as we walk into it, see the bright green tile and you can scan the area. See how big it really is. It's pretty big. Oh, there's the rain. I'm going to put tropical grass there. 
And I was going to put some back here so it can grow in some lush stuff for us. All right, so we have two new entryways into the area. On the east side, there's the river. We can get in perfectly. And of course, we have these two. This one goes over towards the bandstand. And this one goes back over to the blue path. And then there's this bridge over here that will get us in this way and straight over to the storage area if we like. And there's also this path here that's going to lead down to a pretty rainbow bridge. Rainbow Falls. Whoa, our map is just about done. Truly, wow, this area that we're building is very different than all the rest. I'm loving the way it looks, though. <laughs>